Dangerous. Oh no, not a super dynamite time bomb! Wonder how they patented that. That sounds like a dangerous name to patent there. And some what? What the heck? If they can fly, why the heck are they rolling across the ground, avoiding? They could. I mean, they're defying gravity as we speak. But why the heck do I have to roll across the ground to? Uh, I'm, I'm. You can never question game logic ever, ever. All right, world two. Here it is. Here we go, this one is called Banks. Obviously, it's going to have some wavy corners, but don't worry, I'll get you through this with no problem whatsoever. This first one is not hard at all. Just take the inside route, and the physics will do their do their duty, so to speak. But the other one, you have to be a little more careful not to go too fast, otherwise you'll fly right off because it slopes in the other direction. All right, next one is Eaton Floor. It looks like some sort of square creature has eaten it through the floor. I don't, I don't know if they make square creatures out there, but I certainly wouldn't want to be a floor if there is one. So let's just carefully navigate our way through these cracks and stuff like here. It's not hard at all. Just find the bigger spots if you can instead of trying to go through the little ones like I am to take shortcuts. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, we made it to the goal. Next one, hoppers. This one's pretty tough, actually, because you have to learn how to time a switch. Well, I mean, I, not time the switch. I mean, you have to learn the timing. You first go backwards and hit the play switch. This is a fast forward switch, if you can't see that. And now they're slowed down, and now you can go through them a lot easier. Of course, if you didn't hit that switch, you would have to time your way through there. Um, time your way to go through those weird oblong shaped shiny metal things, and that doesn't look very healthy for your... <laughs> because... Um, that would be great for a speedrun if you just ra ran right through it, but it's pretty difficult to do in just in general. Alright, here's Coaster! Yeah! Look at my speed! This one's pretty fun. Don't go too fast or you'll fly right out the edges. So, kind of hold bottom left in a way. That's the best thing that I can tell you to keep your speed going because if you hold uh, just bottom, you'll start to drift towards the right side. And... Yay! Of course, at maximum speed, you'll have a shot at getting some of those bananas behind the goalpost way off the edge. But this is a safe run. This is to teach you guys how to do it the easy way. Well, so to speak. <laughs> Bumpy Chuck! Alright, you've got two ways to go. You can either shortcut through the center or take the safe route through the sides. Well, the safe route's too easy, so why not just, uh, yeah, I'll just do this. <laughs> scary. Scary. Scary! Ah! Okay, yeah, you gotta kind of hit those bumps at an angle so you fly in the correct direction. If you go for the corners, right, like straight on, you're gonna fly right, right off the edge and into the lava. Next up is Swell. Don't go too fast on this one, but you do need a good amount of speed to get through this. L like, because you have to go uphill, but if you go too fast, you're just gonna fly right off. Like, keep it around 80 miles per hour if you can, and uh, there you go. Yay! Happy Monkey! I've always loved the Super Monkey Ball series, <clears throat> so it's about time that I finally do one of these critters. Alright, this is Gravity Slider. It gets thinner and thinner as you go, so just continue to hold forward and do not hesitate one bit. Do not shift to the left, do not shift to the right, just keep holding forward. Why am I slightly off to the left? I don't think this is gonna work. Maybe my controller's access is a little bit off. Oh, please work, please work. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Okay, I overreacted there for nothing. But that was kind of weird. I was just holding uh, straight up right in the slot and I drift slightly off to the left. Oh, well, this one's Inchworms. Now, as you can see by the uh, squiggly platform thingies, whatever you want to call it, way over there, they're going to get a lot faster when you hit that switch. So move backwards, hit the play switch, unless you want to speed run this sucker, which I would not recommend because that would be a little dangerous. Okay, now you got to wait for, wait for it to go. 
like collapse back in and then follow it one segment at a time. One segment at a time. If you drop off, you're gonna fly off because these things are going a lot faster than you think they are. So don't rush it, just go with the pace and then flop right in the goal. Yes, the goal is hanging off the edge. There's gonna be a lot of those weird goal posts like that later on for us to fall in in much harder levels, but that's just the way to introduce us to it. Uh, this one is total terrorism. I think that's how it's pronounced. Alright, as you see, fast forward switch, so there's gotta be a play switch. There it is, hit the play switch, and move back. The bananas, wherever they are, there there is a safe spot. So grab a banana, stay there. And, uh, banana, 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 oh, wait, 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 okay. I guess I wasn't in as much danger as I thought I was. Oh, no, not the post. <laughs> I am a happy little monkey. Next up is Alternative. This one's kind of odd because uh, without hitting that, uh, I mean, because it tricks you into thinking that you should hit this switch here, but it's actually a fast forward switch, so completely avoid that switch. Now, you gotta have some forward rhythm here. Just wait for the platform to come around. And now continue to move forward when you start walking on the platform, otherwise it'll kind of throw you off the edge. And wait for the close and walk forward towards the goal. And there you go. You are a happy monkey. Hold on a sec. Sorry about that, had to make some room on the camera to make sure I get the story sequence in. I'll probably eventually make a mistake and I'll leave out some of the story accidentally because of the camera, but uh, if you want to see the story the full to the full extent, if I do that mistake, play through the game yourself. This game is awesome! I'll take care of this. Stand back. No, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Gong, gong. No, don't do it. No. Uh oh. Only a genius like me could mastermind the sinking of Jungle Island. And look, it's almost time for the explosive event. He he and he he. Uh oh, this looks like it's gonna work out very well. Holy cow! Out of control, Blimp! Panic! 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 Oh, oh, oh. oh my god! And it looks like success goes to the monkeys! I, I, Mimi, Baby, and Gong Gong. Where in the world is Dr. Babu? We gotta capture him! Again, why am I narrating? You can read the text. I can read it even on the tiny LCD screen on the camera, for Pete's sake. Oh, and it looks like we're going underwater. Oh no! Luckily, we're inside plastic bubbles, otherwise, we would be in big trouble! <laughs> oh no! Run, Dr. Baboon, run! The game would end if they caught you so quickly. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> She's so stupid! <laughs> they changed the lyrics for each one too. Sparklies! Let's go in the water. And that's about it for this part, so I guess I'll see you guys in the next part where we do the deep sea. Oh, actually, it's called Under the Ocean. See you guys!